Hello again everyone. Today I have another package for you and this one is from Gail in New Zealand. And here we go. And we have a card. Oh, isn't that pretty? And look at the glitter. Oh, oh it's a birthday card. Oh, how sweet. How pretty. Can you see all the glitter on that? It's just beautiful, Gail. Thank you. Ooh. Dear Jeanette, happy birthday and thank you for your great challenge. It is my first and I have enjoyed doing it. The butterfly was from a a die that was a gift from a dear friend who will be 96 years old this August. Wow, what a wonderful age that is. Hoping it will bring me luck. <laughs> Once again, happy birthday. Thank you, Gail. Oh, wow. Thank you so much. I'll keep my eye out for that butterfly. Uh, now we're looking. I think these are the banners. Let's put that card over there. I have lots of bubble wrap, that's for sure, which is good because when I send the banners out, um, when I send the banners out, it will be, sorry, I was just looking for something, it will be needed, won't it? Isn't this sweet? Look, she's put some little decorations on the wrapping there. Oh, that's lovely, Gail. Thank you. Let's try and... There we go. Oh, isn't that lovely? And on the back, we have we have a little Kiwi bird sticker because, like I said, Gail is from New Zealand, and this must be the butterfly dye. That she's talking about and isn't that pretty I don't think I've ever seen that particular butterfly design well I hope that brings you luck as well Gail that's a lovely die cut isn't it original by Gail Pankhurst and she's done it on a um, either chipboard or thick cardstock base and then she has this lovely like mulberry type of paper over the top the beautiful gold butterfly as she stated from a friend of hers who is 96 lovely gold ribbon all the way around with some lovely satin roses in the corner some white ribbons to tie them together and of course a little kiwi sticker down the bottom and on the other side we have the same kind of mulberry paper down the bottom and then we have um, I've got a feeling that is one lace and it, it has like layers of it so it's either that ruffled layer and this one separately or it's all one but it's like a one two three layers and then there's this beautiful gold trim threaded through it or cording threaded through it in the corners we have these other beautiful satin flowers and they have like little pearl sprays coming out of them which is ever so pretty and that's on all three corners and then we have this lovely gathered chill flower or rosette in the center with a gorgeous little girl image isn't that lovely very sweet little image that one is Gail that's just lovely we have this tied in a bow in this corner here as well that's just lovely. I like that lace. I'm curious whether it is just one or... Yes, it is. It's all one lace. Can you see that? It starts here and it's all one lace, but it's got like three layers of it. That's lovely, Gail. Thank you so much. And we have our other one, and I, I don't know if it's the same or not, so we'll find out. That, 
this it is we have another one that's the same yes exactly the same which is just wonderful makes um my job of putting them all together very easy indeed <laughs> aren't they lovely thank you so much for entering Gail and I'm so happy that you did um because you know the first step is always the hardest to entering challenges and um ladies looking to enter challenges if you actually just type in the top of the YouTube search bar craft challenge and then there's um and then press search then there should be a little filter box underneath the um, suggestions that come up. Um, narrow your search down to this month or you know the last week or two and it should come up with some current challenges just in case you know you don't know how to find challenges you might be just starting out. Once you've been here for a little while you get to know people tell you and um, yeah you usually subscribe to people and they might do a challenge. So. Um, just in case anybody needed to know that because I know a couple have asked me already so these are lovely banners thank you so much for that Gail and Gail has sent a little extra package here with a little flower And we have some oh jolly gems they're called they remind me of you know the lollies the candy the jelly candies you can get aren't they lovely they're so sparkly they're beautiful thank you so much Gail look at that red I could use the red and the green and the white for Christmas time can't I that's wonderful thank you so much for that Oh, and look at the burlap flowers. Oh, they're very nice, aren't they? They're wonderful. Thank you so much. Very nice. And some more. They look like little coasters, don't they? I like those a lot. Oh, they could be very handy for putting in clusters and things. They're great. Or even, you know, when you're doing your um, uh, lace spools, they can go on the top and bottom of those as well. Hmm, lovely. Thank you so much. And we have a chipboard clock. Isn't that pretty? That's a nice elaborate clock, isn't it? Oh, that's really nice. Thank you. Oh, and look, it's chipboard with burlap and they're little telephones. Gosh, we don't see telephones like that anymore, do we? Aren't they nice? Thank you so very much. Oh, isn't that pretty? Designer chipboard, Grace Taylor. Perfect for scrapbooking and crafts. There is only one happiness in life to love and be loved. Oh, isn't that beautiful? That's lovely. I love the colours of it. Oh, it's really lovely. Thank you very much for that. And although it says a special day in it, um, they can be altered up to use in other things, I'm sure. That's wonderful. Thank you very much. And Gail's also put a couple of little bits in a bag here. And now it, it, it's been very slow uploading because I had school holidays and um, my children were on the internet and then I had my daughter, my eldest daughter, home for a couple of weeks and she was on the internet and then all these videos to upload we actually ran out of um, you know internet I can't believe it I haven't ran out of internet in years since I had died dial up oh oh look the little angels and I think that goes there 
like that. These are what um, Hazel used on her banner. And I wasn't sure if she'd made them or whether she'd bought them. Oh, thank you so much. Aren't they sweet? I will definitely be using those on a project for Christmas. They're wonderful and I will glue. I'll just pop that one up on that shelf. And I will glue that back on. They're beautiful. Thank you. And we have some little bows. And some little lollies. Candies. Aren't they cute? Oh, that's lovely. Thank you so much, Gail. That's very kind of you. And um, I do wish you the best of luck with your lucky butterfly. I was calculating or calculating how many um, banners there will end up and it may surprise you there's going to be more than I expected but not too many so they be lovely um, if they all arrive that have said they are on their way. So that's um, that'll be a nice surprise for everyone. And once again, Gail's beautiful banners. Here we go. Aren't they lovely? Thank you so much, Gail. Thank you for entering and thank you everybody for watching. Bye.